The true test of an instructional graphic is if we can look at it and understand the concept without reading the supporting text. The challenges to create effective instructional graphics can be time consuming and costly. To help with this, we've made over 9,000 pre-made PowerPoint graphics and offer them within our PowerPoint graphics library. The graphics are 100% editable within PowerPoint and can export in nearly any software. Let's take a quick look. Notice that every aspect in this graphic is completely editable. So as long as we can type, change colors, and can ungroup, we can change every aspect. If we were to scale this graphic, notice the fonts look a little odd. To fix that, go to the Home tab and choose Decrease Font Size until the font looks as we want it to. If we want to bring this graphic into another application, group all elements together, right-click, and save the graphic out. To maintain a transparent background, choose the PNG file type. Let's take a look at another graphic. As with the previous, we can change every aspect of it. So for example, to highlight a specific region on the map, click on it and simply change the color. We can change any of the styles, lines, weights, shadows, any aspect of it because it is vector artwork, which means it can be scaled to just about any size and maintain its image quality. We can also change any aesthetic aspect. This is a dashboard graphic. We can change the data associated with the quantitative charts. As we change the quantity in the Excel pop-up, watch the pie chart to the left adjust. Change it by simply modifying the Excel pop-up or editing the data from within PowerPoint. Another graphic is a pipe graphic. We're going to quickly edit the style. To edit style, change aesthetic elements associated with it. So for example, Instead of being a gradient fill, we can make it a solid fill. We can outline it and change the line weight. We can also change shapes. So if you don't like cubes and you'd rather have spheres, simply change the shapes to circles. If we want to get rid of the arrows, click on and delete them. We can change every aspect. We can change the style and the look and feel within seconds. Here's a pyramid graphic. With some graphics, we get a lot more elements than we need. So for example, let's say we only need eight layers on the pyramid graphic. We would ungroup the graphic and delete the elements we don't need. Let's say we only need two segments at the bottom. To do this, I would click on the separators and the text boxes and delete those that I don't need. Here's a little trick. Everything is grouped logically. Ungroup this pie chart or stack graphic and notice how each layer is grouped as one unit. If we wanted to isolate just one of the pie wedges, simply ungroup it one more time and pull the pie wedge out. Here's a map graphic. To modify any of these connecting lines, click on them, delete them, or grab the endpoint and scale to connect anywhere. Here's another trick. So let's say we want to change all the spirals to be the same color. Select the colored element you want and use the Format Paintbrush to apply the same color treatment to each element. Our PowerPoint graphics are unbelievably easy to work with. With over 50 categories of graphics, you're sure to find some for your next project.